uh, just to make it shorter. Uh, also, um, we have uh, progressed quite a bit since uh, that introduction was written. We raised over $300 million, progressed uh, uh, multiple uh, uh, therapeutic assets uh, uh, into preclinical and clinical um, stages. So we're already clinical. And today I'm gonna to be presenting to you uh, the story of uh, longevity medicine uh, as a field. Uh, it's a, a new type of uh, medicine, a new field of medicine that is um, guided by aging clocks uh, and artificial intelligence, uh, and also focuses on restoring function rather than just preventing. And uh, since we have very little time today to go through um, many of the aspects of longevity medicine, uh, you can always go to longevity of degree and get a CME accredited course uh, and a range of other courses for free. Uh, it's a volunteer initiative uh, run by multiple medical doctors and PhDs. Uh, over 6,000 people took this course already, uh, well, registered for the course. Uh, and today I'm going to give you an introduction to longevity medicine and uh, uh, AI powered uh, aging clocks. However, I encourage you to go to longevity degree and take the course. Also, sign up for um, my Forbes.com uh, column um, uh, blog where you can uh, read about uh, about the pharmaceutical industry productivity and also of, about longevity. And I think that. Uh, uh, longevity in general is the most altruistic field to be in. It's very important to um, contribute to this field and uh, uh, you're generating the maximum number of quality adjusted life years if you're contributing to longevity. So longevity medicine is a new branch of uh, precision medicine uh, that is focused on extending health span and lifespan uh, and is powered by aging clocks and AI technologies. So many uh, many aspects of longevity medicine uh, include multi-omics, deep biomarkers of aging, so biomarkers of aging developed using deep learning, precision imaging, deep aging clocks, robotics, and smart technologies.